Hello, welcome to Megger's technical support video series, Frequently Asked Questions. In this video, we will discuss how to operate the Digiphone 2 Plus in ESG mode. Let's get started. The ESG mode is used for locating sheath faults in buried cables. In order to minimize the amount of time needed to locate the fault, tracing the cable route prior to fault pinpointing is recommended. In order to locate a sheath fault in buried cable, a DC pulse generator is connected to the faulted cable and sends a DC pulse to the fault. The pulse dissipates through the ground surrounding the faulted area of the cable. The two measuring probes from the ESG are used to measure the step voltage and indicate the direction that the fault is in. It is important to ensure that the orientation of the probes remains consistent during the fault location process. As voltage gradients induced by the current flowing back from the fault position exist around the earthing point of the generator, the measurement values near this point might be elevated. However, the deflection direction will also indicate the direction of the fault position at this point. At the halfway point between the generator and the fault position on the cable, the signal strength is at a minimum. When we move nearer to the fault, the signal strength increases again. The maximum signal strength is measured when one of the earth spikes is directly above the fault. If the fault is exactly between the two earth spikes, or exactly to one side, the indicator unit does not display a reading. If the fault position has been passed by, the polarity changes. The signal on the indicator unit points in the opposite direction. To correct any possible lateral offset, insert the two earth spikes at an angle of 90 degrees to the cable route and determine the fault location by following the indicator unit. Once the fault has been pinpointed, the location of the fault can be marked and the surge generator and the digiphone unit can be turned off. The cable is now ready for excavation and repair. This concludes the presentation on how to operate the Digiphone 2 Plus in ESG mode. Visit the Megger YouTube channel for more videos including technical webinars, product overviews, and other how-to presentations similar to this one. Contact us for questions or more information about this topic or for any support you may need for your electrical testing.